most collectible, most uh, exclusive turquoise that money cannot buy. You can't buy this anywhere. The mine closed uh, back in the 80s. There's simply nothing else available. This is from a private collection. Jay has acquired it. We've not last, we last saw Hubei about four years ago, uh, and that was just a tiny, tiny amount that we had. This is a beautiful 36 inch necklace. To those that own Hubei, they would truly, in most cases, never sell it. And that's why people classify it as priceless. Thousands of dollars, maybe, it depends on you know, the person. The price that we all offer tonight is accessible for everybody to own it and treasure it and pass it down from generation to generation. So, to make sure you're ready, the official graphics will go up at 10 past nine. Uh, that's when we'll accept the calls, obviously hsn.com. Please be ready to order as soon as we do it because it will be an immediate sellout on original, genuine, authentic Hubei. The clock is ticking. We're now nine minutes away. Let's start this hour with a bang. Let's talk about an American mine. We only have a few of these. First time at the low price as we start to focus in on turquoise as well in this hour. Silver City, New Mexico, a three minute special. Uh, Jay, beautiful, look at the design with the pendant. Do you, do you know uh, anything about Silver City, New Mexico? Only what you've told me. Okay, because if you're driving through and you spit, you just missed it. <laughs> <laughs> no, I hope, guys, I hope they don't take offense to that. I don't mean that, guys. I, I used to land there a lot. I know I what you mean. I okay. know what you mean. Um, it's, it's, it's called Tyrone, and it's out of a little town in southwestern New Mexico, and it's called Silver City. Okay. And it was called City, Silver City for, for a reason. I mean, it's, um, uh, it's a, definitely a mining community. Um, this is one of our uh, exclusive, this is a gallery design. Beautiful. Okay, this is an American turquoise. Now, th this isn't, think about this. When I was buying turquoise when I first started out in the 70s, yes. right? I know it's hard for you to believe. <laughs> okay. When I started buying, when I first got in the jewelry business, uh, that's what I specialized in. That's what I grew up with was turquoise, right? There was like 27 different turquoise mines. 27. That, 27 that I was buying from. Okay. 27. Of those 27 mines, yep. of those 27 turquoise mines, yep. The Kingman mine is the only mine that is still actively producing of the 27 is the only one. So there, of the 27, I used to be, it used to be it was down to the Kingman and the Sleeping Beauty mine. Right. And now Sleeping Beauty, of course, you know, that's gone. Yeah. That's, that, there is no more of that. That's like, that's like printing money. Yeah. Um, and the Kingman mine is still producing high grade material, but it's the only one. This is Tyrone, okay. It wasn't one of the mines that I was buying from at that time. Um, it's been around. It's not like that I couldn't, I just didn't know about it, right? Um, I think that they started developing this, and I don't want to misspeak, but I think in 1930s okay. is when they, originally when they started mining the turquoise out of this mine. This, it's a, a small the, operation. It's a very small operation. The man who owns it now, it's, he's actually teaching his daughter. Okay. It's, it's a, a, a father-daughter uh, project. Mm. And they still have uh, rough material, uh, but it, it's no big thing. I, I think um, he, if, if he, he's still like, he's like a, uh, uh, you know, he works in the mining industry, but he's like a geologist, mineralogist, you know, mm -hmm. that's what, you know, that he actually does uh, for a living. So um, this mine uh, produces some nice material, but very, very little material. We're, you know, proud that we uh, had the ability to get in and buy it and be able to use this. It's very rare that we actually use this material in a beaded necklace, okay? <laughs> that's that is, that's more rare than not. It's not inexpensive and it's very hard to get and there's not a lot of it. And this is a gallery design, here again, exclusive, uh, something unique, something different, and you won't see this anyplace else. But if you're a turquoise collector, and especially American turquoises, guys, yeah. um, are highly collectible. Highly, highly collectible. But it's nice to learn about and to discover a new turquoise, Jay. I mean, that's the thing. If you're a collector of turquoise, to get Tyrone, I mean, I don't think I've ever presented Tyrone with you before. Well, I have to tell you, if you come to my man cave, yeah. my, I call it my studio, <laughs> Sheila calls it her man cave, um, you go in and I have literally two shelves that are probably, they gotta be at least 20 feet long. Wow and um, they're probably 12 inches wide, and that's where I keep my specimens for turquoise. Just those two shelves are nothing but turquoise. 
Um, those are all the different mines I've bought from in my life. If you go into my office, you'll look at about, there's probably 50 different mines that wow. I display in my wow. office, different specimens. Um, of those, maybe I have material on 10 that I actually still have rough material that I, to work. Unbelievable. 10. So that's how rare. And you know, with the turquoise, is, that's what, you know, we, when we were at the turquoise symposium, we were, everybody was discussing this how the value of turquoise keeps going up and yeah, up yeah. and the rarity of it. And um, the big talk was, and you know what? We're not seeing any new development. We're not seeing any new mines. I'm not getting any any new material from anybody. And the demand isn't going anywhere. Um, guys, we're gonna do a quick showcase. Obviously, Hubei, we are five minutes away, folks. Please bear with us five minutes now. I wanna quickly show you this. It's a beautiful, gorgeous final quantity on this cuff. Okay, and this, again, if you want collectability, you want rare, this is a cup that I designed. These are the kind of cups that I wear. And um, this is Sonoran Blue, which is a really rare, unique material, and it has watermark in it. Mm. See the watermark? And this material, uh, this turquoise was actually an exclusive for us for a long time. This is also Sonoran Blue, if you see that. This, this material is incredible. And what, what really, is collectible about it, it has watermark. That's natural watermark inside the material. Makes it highly collectible, and this is what all the big time gold designers, this is the kind of material that they look for mm. to be able to put in their designs. It's very, very upscale, very, very high end. So this is Sonoran Blue. We used to have an exclusive on this material, mm. but, um, and this bracelet is new and exclusive actually for the show. We're. Actually, they're getting to see it for the very first yep. time here. Just so you know, this isn't something we've been trying to sell. No, no right? they, they, this is new. <laughs> You're getting mm -hmm. to see it. This is all part of our gallery collection. And this is a, a new series. I'm, I, you know, I wear cuffs, and everybody keeps telling me, okay, I want to see more cuffs. I want to see it. So cuffs. we're going to do these limited runs, and we're going to do these. These, these. when you feel the metal weight yeah, in these. Yeah, a lot there. Okay, this is substantial, right? That hence the price and everything, very substantial, the materials, but even the price, guys, is nothing what you would have to pay anywhere else, no. right? I mean, you're really, you're getting to buy these pretty much manufactured direct. But this is a, um, it's, it's just a, a really unique piece of wearable art. Talking of wearable art, here is the other one. This is the Sonoran Blue Turquoise Cross with the chain, obviously, as well. So you're gonna get that gorgeous silver chain, uh, 18 and a quarter inches, goes to about 21 inches. Cross is always significant, always popular. This and a, a, a beautiful, unique design on it. Okay, okay. Um, okay, if you go back, anybody who's a designer, I don't consider myself a designer, just so you know. <laughs> I, 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 design, I, I design a lot of jewelry, and I've done it my entire life. But <laughs> I don't consider myself a designer. I have designers that I work with, that, you know, that are in my family and everything, that are truly artists and designers. I consider myself a redneck rock hound. <laughs> but I will tell you this right now. There is no designer ever in, in their, if you go back in their history, they have designed crosses or hearts. It's just the way it is. Yeah. And this right here, I thought I would never ever, every time I see a new cross design, I, I always freak out because I can't believe somebody actually it's figured out another yes. cross design. And look how cool that is. I don't even go close on that. That is just the coolest cross it design. Is, it is. I think it's one of those, and the size of that, just, you know, if you bought, if you had to buy that cabochon, just yeah. that cabochon, that turquoise, and that clarity, and that quality, in that material, the, the cabochon alone, literally wholesale, would be like $110 to $120. Just by itself. Wholesale. Wholesale for that cap. That's $139.98 on a sale price. Again, just a few of those left. Our last of this showcase is actually brand new, very limited edition, as it were. $264.50. Jay, I see a lot of silver presents mixed in with this beautiful turquoise. Five strands of it. Okay, and this is um, Angel Peak. So this is Chilean material. And this is one of the first times that we actually incorporated this much silver in with the turquoise I on the it. beads. I think it's very upscale. Man. It is. It I is. think it's very upscale. I think it's very contemporary. And to tell you the truth, for the, the amount of silver and the amount of uh, turquoise beads in this, the price, even though this is one of the, a little bit of a higher price point, this is brand new. It's exclusive. You've never seen this before. It's an amazing, amazing look. It's a fun look. It's very rich looking, very contemporary, but very rich. And it's one of the first times ever that we've put that much silver in one of our bead designs. And obviously with the five strands together, forgive me for leaving it a little 
skewy there, but you, you, you get the idea. It looks so, so special. Well, the moment has come. And you know, doing this job, these are the moments that we look forward to when they really are once in a lifetime. Opportunities that are so scarce and so rare. In a few moments, we'll be officially unveiling and revealing the pricing on an original, authentic Hubei necklace that dates back to, in terms of the material, the 70s. A mine that has been closed since the early 80s, Hubei Turquoise is regarded amongst those that know as the most sought after, the most collectible, certainly a signature turquoise. But money can't buy it because you can't find it. And if you can't find it, people can name their own price. What would you pay for real Hubei? Take a look for a second at what is 36 inches of Hubei. It is actually the longest Hubei necklace Jay has ever been able to produce. It's been four years since we had any Hubei on the network. Tonight, because it's Jay's final show of the visit, and it's been a big visit a couple days ago. Jay had a Today special and obviously great success. Uh, we wanted to end the visit with this. Due to early sales, the folks had to move it up to right now. So here's what will happen. For those that have watched Jay for 28 years, you know this really is a once in a lifetime moment in time. For those that are joining us for the first time, what we are about to do is unveil a shockingly low price for genuine Hubei. I mean, that's what it is. So as soon as you see it, please start to order. I'll keep you posted, obviously, as we sell this down. Um, we do have a stretch bracelet as well. I'll give you the price on that in a moment. So, without further ado, we talked about thousands of dollars. <laughs> I mean, it's so dependent on what somebody's willing to sell it for since you can't buy it anymore. We are really proud to say and to reveal that instead of high, high, high prices, we're going low, low, low price to make it accessible at one nine nine one hundred and ninety nine dollars and ninety eight cents folks it's real it's genuine and it's true if you only buy one thing in this show clearly it has to be this at a hundred and ninety nine dollars beautiful sizing you've got the drama it's genuine hubei already 600 people placing orders i will tell you right out of the gate this is the three strand bracelet that's available, that's coming in at $119. But the beauty of this is that it is a stretch. And again, that is genuine Hubei as well. How many necklaces left? Guys, I have 350 necklaces left. That is all, 350, that's hardly anything. I thought this would sell out super fast. I was wrong, it's gonna sell out even faster. 350 necklaces left. How many of the bracelets now, please, Kevin? Okay, we have more of the bracelet. That's the good news. If you want the bracelet, place your order as fast as possible. I'm gonna head back over here and let's talk Hubei. I'm gonna take this giant neck form because <laughs> we need the super size to fit the 36 inches. Jay, how big a deal, how significant is this? Well, you know, in what we do, this, these are, this is what I call a miracle buy, yes. right? Of, it took four years guys and it's not this is okay there, there's turquoises have become very collectible yes and there are a lot of american turquoises that are highly collectible that they pay, pay huge money for mm -hmm. if you went to the turquoise uh, symposium they had a auction and some of these specimens i mean and i have a lot of them uh, really nice specimens mm -hmm. they go for huge huge money uh hubei now this is it, the story of hubei and I, I don't know if you could go in i don't know if you, you actually Come in Jay, on this. excuse me, sir, one second. I'm gonna, guys, because I want you to hear as much as possible of the information, I'm gonna stop speaking. So the last thing I'm gonna say is this. The bracelet is selling as quickly as the necklace. I understand that. Obviously, people wanna have a slice of Hubei and the bracelet might be the way to go. This will be sold out in the next five to six minutes. The bracelet is selling as quickly as the necklace. So again, grab it where you can and let's enjoy Jay's story. Jay, you were saying about this. Okay, well, the story with Hubei, and this is as much of a, it's a really unique turquoise uh, story. It's, it's what they call vintage. It's, a, a, it's historical vintage collectible turquoise. Okay, do you see this? This is what made Hubei, th this is all natural Hubei. Do you know what? These are my sales samples <laughs> from the 80s. Really? My sales samples. And this is what I, you know, the, these have been in my private collection. I, want, I have had people try to buy these 
out of my specimen cases, I will not sell them. That's how, at that's, any price. At any price. I, I will not. I will not sell these at any price. You can't get this. This is my original sales uh, sales samples that I had when I was selling turquoise rough in this material. This this material is such a unique. It's an American story, but it's it's also a China story. Okay, and you know people don't realize it wasn't. And, and I know there's a lot of conflict right now, but you know back in the day, you know China, you just didn't go into China. Okay, right. the, I mean it was it was you you didn't go in. Westerners were not allowed. Right. You weren't allowed in. It was Americans who actually when they first discovered turquoise, it was Americans from Arizona, Nevada. And my old partner, uh, actually mentor, uh, was one of, uh, was a person he was in his 30s that went in and not only showed them how to mine the material, they, they showed them how to cut the material, how to work it, and they also marketed it for them and actually made a market for it. This is literally vintage, it's, it's, it's a old vintage turquoise. You can't get this anywhere. And to us to find this, we went around, okay, uh, one of my friends that went around and went to all the old cutters, right? Now, I'm talking about people that live in the middle of nowhere. I'm not talking about major factories. I'm talking about people that were Hubei cutters back in the 80s, right? right? And, and maybe, you know, mid 80s. Um, here, this is a great photo. I hope we can bring this up. I want to show it. The, the man uh, with the little uh, Chinese man, that is Simon Chu, right? Mm -hmm. He's in his 30s then. And he, that's him in America when he first came and first brought the first samples of this material. Really? And that was his partner at the time wow. and really his mentor and the money guy behind it all. And he was one of the, the guys that was a promoter and cutter. And then you had people like Chet Jones and a lot of people that went over later um, and went into an area that had no infrastructure, no roads. There, those are American. That's Simon. And those, those two uh, men still, uh, still live. That's the town of Hubei in the background wow, there. Wow, Jay. And that, that is back in the late 70s, early 80s. Uh, when they were there. And they're, they're some of the Americans that originally made this happen, wow. that really built this. This is the, the original, that was the, head, that was the quarters where everybody <laughs> slept and everything at the, at the mine, if you want to call it. You can't, you know what, as a Westerner, I'm not even allowed in that area anymore. Is that right? I couldn't go into the Hubei mine. Through that door, there's a door right there. Yeah. You can see the mountain in the back. Yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. That is, in the back of that, is where the shaft is. And if you went back in that, into the, through that door, yeah. there's a door there. If you could get back in that door, Simon took this um, about five years ago wow. when he was there. They're actually on it. They're, okay, there's the, the main headquarters. That goes back into the mine. That goes back to the shafts. And there's that, that whole mountain back there is honeycombed with shafts. Wow. But you're not allowed in there anymore. They don't allow anybody to go in there. You can never mine it. It's all blocked off. They're putting a museum in this major, and Simon's one of the people, uh, when he was there, he was um, able to, uh, to, they, they wanted him there. They did a whole expose on him. He's passed away, unfortunately, uh, last year. Um, uh, it broke my heart. So right there, there's Kelly. That's the, Kelly, there's Simon. Kelly's in the red shirt. Simon, that, that was my mentor. And then uh, Dennis, his other brother. And then the far person, that was the nephew. And he was the one that actually found, not this Hubei, yeah. but the Hubei stash that we had at that time that when we did this. Wow. And si uh, Dennis, uh, Dennis and Kelly are both uh, still with us. But Simon, like I said, unfortunately passed away. But he is such a national figure. He's part of the Chu family. He's such a national figure that they actually are making, they make a, made a Hubei museum. No. And they have like statues and stuff like that. It's really, really amazing. I, I think they spent like $12 million or something like that to do it. It's a big deal. This material is unbelievably collectible. And it's totally, totally rare, guys. And here's, here's what makes it so rare, right? Is the, the fact no other turquoise looks like this. There is no other turquoise. I've been doing this for a long time, okay? And I'm really good, okay? I, I'm not saying I'm perfect, okay? 
And because there's always those people out there, and I could name five right now, I'm not gonna name names, <laughs> that will think that, they're, that they are more perfect than me. Yeah, and yeah. honestly, they probably are. <laughs> yeah, okay, no. are, they, you know, that they really, there, there are people that, I think I know a lot about turquoise, but I have a lot of friends and a lot of people that I know in yeah. this industry that are much more knowledgeable than I am, that are, uh, they've probably forgotten about more about turquoise <laughs> than, I, than I know. Um, so I'm not saying I am the best of the best, but I'm pretty darn good, okay? Um, and I will tell you right now, this material is so rare, it's impossible to get. I, I have been, they have been bugging me and bugging me and bugging me and hounding me. Is there any way you can find Hubei? We really had to go out and really, really beat the bushes. Um, we've got this, and I have a little surprise maybe later on down the road that maybe we, we don't know yet. Mm -hmm. um, but we'll, I'm just telling you, honestly, you cannot get this material. It is impossible to find it. And, to, and also, they can name their own price. Yeah. Now, we also have to design with what we get. Yes. Yeah. So here again, if I could get pieces like this, yeah. um, literally, I, the, the, the rough um, would be thousands of dollars. Right, right. Uh, you know, to, to be able to get this, we, we had, you know, we're, we're just taking what, you know, like where they had smaller material, we found smaller material that maybe at that time they wouldn't cut something mm -hmm. that small, mm -hmm. and they had it stashed, and we had to kind of like put this together. Now, we didn't even make a small fraction of what they wanted. I'm sure. We weren't able, to, sure. we weren't, we weren't able to even make a small fraction of what they wanted for this show. And, um, you know, what they wanted, I just said, yeah, right, you know. Like, and, you know, here's the thing. Even though you go out and you really do your best and everything, yeah. it still wasn't good enough. <laughs> <laughs> they were going, no, no, you, you, no, more, we need more, more. of those. Uh, you know, and here's the thing. I have convinced everybody. When, when you don't have the rough, you can't make yeah, more yeah. designs, right? But if you want something in turquoise in your collection that you will covet, is, it, that is amazing, 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 this is it. Now, the necklace, if you saw it, had all the colors in it. So that is sold out. Okay. The, and the bracelet will be next to go. Okay. We have 200 bracelets left before well, it's completely the, gone. The bracelets were the smaller material. That's why we gave you three strands mm -hmm. of them. Um, but it's all cut from the Hubei rough. And there's no mistaking Hubei rough. No. There's, there's no, no way to imitate it at all. Like I said, it's one of those, it's one of those turquoises, to be honest with you that you don't even have to really be a turquoise connoisseur right. or a rock hound to really know. Anybody who's got basic knowledge is on turquoises. It's one of those turquoises that you don't have to guess. Right. That you can say that's Hubei. You can spot it. You, you know yeah, what it you is. You know that's what it is. There's only one turquoise that looks like it. To have any slice of Hubei in your collection is money well spent because money can't buy it. That's why so many folks regard it as priceless because 40 years old. This is a story that has already been told. This is one of those rare moments in time. It's and vintage. It's, it's antique. Vintage. It's and antique. They even call it antique. Vintage antique turquoise. It's one of the few that they that it, it's actually given that name. If you would like to get yours, again, the couple hundred left. If there's even one left, I'll keep it out here to remind anybody. Congratulations. The necklace obviously is now sold out. Um, I hope you're riding good health and happiness. You just got one of the most spectacular pieces. Uh, we're not done with Jay, though. Still 35 minutes left. Coming up at midnight tonight, a new day will begin. We're getting a little bit festive. Well, actually, very festive with our uh, Deck the Halls. What will it be? It's something festive, something to decorate with. Suzanne is going to be here to reveal what it is. That's at midnight tonight to find out more. All right, we're going to take a couple moments out, have a quick sip of water as we reset after that amazing moment. We've got more specials, Black Friday deals and clearance items after this. Let HSN be your personal shopper this holiday season. Join us as our hosts share their holiday faves. Catch our hottest deals, coolest offers, and special surprises. Holiday Host Faves starts Friday at midnight on HSN.
about one less thing with our Protection Plus plans at HSN. Electronics, fitness equipment, even jewelry can be covered. Shop smart and protect your purchase. It's easy to add when you're checking out. Search Protection Plus at hsn.com for more details. We love our gemstones to be beautiful, colorful, and durable. That's why we give some of them a little more love. Enhancements may require special care and may not be permanent, while others may last a lifetime. For more information, visit hsn.com and search Gemstone Care to see our Gemstone Enhancement Chart. The Yarn Household holds a huge gingerbread house decorating competition, and we get serious. It started with just the kids, now it's all the adults. We have icing, sprinkles, absolutely everything, and we get fierce. Yeah, the yarns don't play around when it comes to food. We're finding out Mary with Mr. J. King in this show. Um, obviously, we want to still surprise you with phenomenal deals for the rest of this hour. I think you're going to love what Jay and I have in store. Again, this is Jay's final show of the visit, and we want to make sure we go out on a high. Um, let's go next to, and we have Black Friday deals coming in clearance items, but I did want to stop the show to talk about Purple Kunzite for a second, because this is brand new, and our pre-sales on this online have been through the roof. Maybe it's that beautiful shape, 28 by 27 millimeters. Maybe it's the color, Jay, but this is hot. You know, and this is another one of those really rare, this is, brand, this is a brand new uh, design, but, and this is an exclusive. And, um, you know, we listen to our viewers. I mean, when you, when you guys ask for something, it's not like I just, you know, write that down and go, yeah, right, and I <laughs> and ignore you. Um, one of the things that we've been asked for is that they really like, um, and, you know, when I say smaller, for us, small, if you see this, smaller for me is half the size of Adam's hand. <laughs> a a three-finger deal for me is, is, is that's what I considered fatigue. Okay, so on this, this is a two-finger deal. So, you know, it's not, you know, like... This is about as petite as mind fight gets, guys. I mean, we, we do some, but I mean, but you know, my thing is you want to you want to see the material, you want to showcase it. And this is really a rare material. This is a semi-precious material. And this is kunzite. Go online and read about this. Um, they find it basically. My basic resource on kunzite is Brazil. Uh, I have two miners there that I buy. It's more of a pinky material. This is a purple kunzite, which is even rarer. I believe, I've, I only have one source, and this comes out of all places, Nigeria. Now, I gotta tell you, I don't get a lot of material out of Nigeria, <laughs> right? And I, I don't really have a lot of Nigerian connections. Actually, the, my Zambian uh, emerald guy, uh, that's the Zambian emerald mi uh, miner. He's the one that turned me on to the Nigerians, you know, so, <laughs> you know, like it's, in, in this business is not really what you know, because trust me, I don't know anything, <laughs> but um, it's who you know, right? It's true. And, um, that, and that's what made this possible. But you can see this on Aaron. Is this a cool look? Gorgeous. And these are the kind of designs, guys, to tell you the truth, this is brand new. These are exclusive. You can't get them anywhere else. Mm -mm. This is the kind of stuff you can't go into any jewelry store mm -mm, mm -mm. and find. You can't even go to, to be honest with you, I don't even know if you could go to an artist community and find this. Right. This, this th number one, they have to have the rough to be able to do it. And this is really, really rare. And it is a semi-precious material. Look at the size of that cab, man. We go Massive. all, wait, look at that. Look at the thickness on this. Look at the silver work. Again, these are all designed by us. They're all created from scratch. With us. The only thing that I don't make on this is I don't do the chain. Mm. And the chain we buy from a friend of ours who's an Italian manufacturer, oh, nice. which they make the finest. Okay. I don't know anybody in the world that the Italians, the Italians make the finest chain with German technology. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> all of the machinery in any Italian chain factory, um, they're all German <laughs> machines and the Germans, but the Germans really don't manufacture the chain, funny enough. You know, crazy. the Italians, um, they have the, the finesse and they make it. It's the way the and world also, works. Yeah, also, you know, in gold, uh, Turkey, 
of yeah, all places. Turkey, yeah. Turkey's really They're become famous. where they, you know, where they, uh, they're doing. But this is Italian chain. A really, really super high grade, won't kink on you. It's really, really nice material. But we don't make the chain. They make the chain. So if anything goes wrong with the chain, it's not my fault, right? <laughs> and then, um, but we do the Kunzite and we also do all the silver work. Uh, there. It's edgy, it's cool, it's chic, it's sophisticated. You'll love this. Necklace nearly gone, earrings available as well, $115. If you love J. King, and who doesn't, you could apply today for an HSN credit card and save $30 off your first single item purchase, um, and then get introduced and invited to many VIP perks and benefits. Um, one of the things that we've been doing throughout the show, and I, I said at the start that we had three Black Friday deals, we're about to showcase our final Black Friday deal. You gotta have an eagle eye for these things because a Black Friday deal traditionally is a best-selling item, one of our biggest selling items that they cut a price on. Um, our best deal of the season. I wanna show you this first so you get a kind of feel for it. Biggest, chunkiest, boldest necklace that we have had all show long. It is, uh, I think, admired by all that see it. It's beautiful. It is every shade, every color that makes you smile. It is quartzite from a 13 by 13 all the way up to a 25 by 25. It is quartzite in this hexagonal design that just looks a million dollars. All right, we're gonna, first thing, forgive me, producer Kevin, how many of these are available for the Black Friday deal? Okay, so a little over 1,800 are available at our Black Friday deal price. If we're ready, let's reveal it. Down to the lowest price ever of $89.98. Now remember, this isn't a string of tiny beads. <laughs> this is massive, big, and bold. You would go into a department store and probably pay more than that for fashion jewelry, faux jewelry. This is the real thing. It's um, a quartzite story that we'll talk about. We're also doing five flex pay and free shipping and handling. The good news is, because this is more than $75, we're activating the free shipping for you. So it's the Black Friday deal. It's the free shipping and handling. It's the five flexible payments and our extension extended return policy you have till the end of January to decide if you want it. This obviously will be another sellout tonight. It's 808-955. Jay, from the moment this necklace launched, the feedback came back, even at our regular pricing. People love this. It's an unusual size for you, though, this. The, sh the shape and size is massive. This is, um, I don't know if I could say this. Say it. It just does. This is my Wilma Flintstone look. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> Can I say that? Well, are, you, are you allowed yeah. to say that? Well, we said it now. Okay, well, it's your fault. <laughs> I'm coming to uh, You said I could. Okay, so literally think about this design. Okay, now love it or hate it. If you hate it, I, I'm good with that. Oh, we okay. love it. But I have to tell you, this is for me, this is this is why I do, this is, this is my type of design, all right? I like this big, bold look. You know, my thing is go big, go home. Anybody who knows me, if you see, like, you, if you see my Jeep, if you see my truck, <laughs> big, right? Big. <laughs> if you see, the, like, when I wear jewelry and stuff or watches or anything like this, my thing, I like big, right? If you can't see it, then why bother, <laughs> you know? These are the kind of designs, and this is cool. This, this has such a feel for it. It does. This, so mel this is a, a very rare form of quartzite. It's very hard. I loved it. I fell in love with this material. And here again, I bought this um, a few years back, the rough. And this isn't like there's a no quartzite mine for this, right? We, they, they found this was for Rockhound, basically. I bought it. I had it for a long time. We said, it, this is all natural. There's nothing done to this. It's just the natural look of this material. It's beautiful. It, it kind of reminds me of, of almost look. like... It almost, look at it on Aaron. Though. Come on, this guys, this is $89. It looks like you spend $8,000. Uh, look at this, but look at the sizes. And even on Aaron, Aaron is very petite. But do you see, I mean, it's just one of those, it's one of those it's pow, a wow. it's one of those pow, like, you know, like when you walk into a room mm. or if you go anywhere and you have this, I guarantee you there's not anybody that's not gonna look at this, mm. right? Um, hopefully it's not people that you don't want it to look <laughs> at. But I mean, you know, like, let's be honest, you know, like, why do you, why do you have things, I mean, do you always want things that everybody's got? 
And then, you know, every, you know, like, you know, like you just, everybody has that, right? Mm -hmm. I mean, you know, just like, and you know, like my wife, Sheila and I, we, you know, people will say, even if you go into our house and everything, they'll, they'll go, that's different. You know, that's unique. That's, that's what we like. Even, you know, like our cars or anything we do, we like to have things that are different, right? We have to, we like have, you know, things that we put our own little spin on. And this is my spin on this. I kept it contemporary, but I wanted it big and bold. And you look at it, you look at it in Adam's hands, you think, it's oh massive. my God, that, that's way too, you know, too massive maybe. But you see it on Aaron, you'll see what it is. It has a great look to it. Um, I'm not even going to the value on this because to tell you the truth, you know, like here again, um, I have a different perspective on this because I, we are the manufacturers. You know the inside scoop. No, no, no. We're we're the manufacturers. I, I, you know, I made this from the rough material. I did the design on this. We did all the cutting. We put this whole thing together. Nobody has ever touched this, but but except you know Jenkins. us, right? We didn't buy anything from this. Even the finding on this, we made the findings on this. We made the whole thing. So I know what it costs. I know what the labor costs are. I know what those shipping costs are. I know what our packaging, our marketing, our cutting costs, the cost of the natural rough. And I'm just telling you right now, okay, like this is a ridiculous, ridiculous deal. Um, even, to be honest with you, the original prices that we sell this at, there you're really more or less buying this at wholesale or maybe right under that, you know, sure. like, um, you know, we're manufacturers, right? So, you know, like if you have a manufacturer, do you realize there's at least five steps usually between you and the retailer? Exactly. It's Even a lot on of material steps. like this, you know, guys, normally uh, people that weren't buying it directly from the miner or the person that got it, they would be buying it from somebody who sold it to a rock yard, who sold it to a distributor, who mm -hmm. sold it to a wholesaler, who sold it to a lapidary. Price, price, just, price. Yeah, just to be able to actually get the material to cut it. And that's where where we're able to give you the deals that we give you. And it's just because of how we are, you know, we've got a very niche business and we have an extremely rare, rare opportunity in how we make things and how we market. I don't know of anybody who does exactly what we do. No, nobody, that's now, a secret. I, I, that's, not, that's not saying that I know everybody in the world and I don't, <laughs> but I don't know I don't know of anybody who really has everything that we have for our no, business. No, no, no. And one of the big components, a lot of people actually can, that go to the mines and that they do manufacture. There's several people I know that do that. Um, but nobody that has their own show on Home Shopping Network <laughs> they can sell directly to you. Only you, Jay. <laughs> well, okay, so far. <laughs> <laughs> There'll never be another. No, well, I don't know. There'll don't, never be another. I, I don't know. I don't know don't if any, know, anybody but... really would want another. <laughs> but, uh, that's One's a, enough. Yeah, one, trust me, one was more than enough. So, but, you know, I'm just saying that, you know, when you look at these deals, and I look at these deals, and then you wonder... If they people really realize what an incredible what goes into it, yeah, what an incredible value that is, and that the impossibility of me, even as a manufacturer, being able to bring that and sell at that price. Do you know if I could sell it at that price, I'd do it all day long, but I can't. There's no way I could do that. And we work really hard, just so you know, um, to be able to come in even at our original prices. And we work on volume. We don't work on. Um, we don't make, you know, like huge money. We work on a very small percentage, and we do that because, to tell you the truth, we want to give you the biggest bang for your right. buck. And that's why I think we've been around for 28 years. Well, long may it continue. I will say th this type of thing is not, uh, you know, Jay and I often talk about this on TV, but this kind of thing is a, a unique HSN deal. HSN doesn't kind of distinguish between a pair of jeans from last season or a piece of jewelry. I, when they discount it, they did. how rare is this? They don't know, really. I mean, again, these are different departments all working cohesively, but ultimately we benefit by sharing with you, our customers, a Black Friday deal. So we've got Black Friday deals on TVs and on fashions and beauty and jewelry. This is a mega popular piece from Jay, but there's only a few left. They marked it down as a Black Friday deal and the Black Friday um, uh, kind of fine print is as follows. This is the lowest price of the season that you're gonna see on this piece, but it's only good until it sells out. And it is selling out, as you would imagine, because it is a big, bold, gorgeous look. And if you look in the magazines, you'll notice that neckline presence is what it's all about. People want the big, the bolder. It's a unique piece in your collection. You see it on Aaron. Look at it on Aaron. It's a million dollars, right? 
Okay, you're gonna see a clock appear on the screen. It's gonna be, I think, three minutes or sell out, whichever happens first. I will, give, thank you guys. I will give you fair warning. After this, we have a clearance opportunity, which is also gonna rock the house for sure. So please stand by. If you're a bargain hunter, we certainly have things for you. Tis the season to buy gifts for folks. Buy this for somebody you love and adore or buy it for yourself. Jay, the, the jewelry, as I'm sure you hear from everybody you meet, jewelry is something that folks love and it brings so much happiness for so many, many, many years. Okay, and I'll speak to the guys out here because I am a guy, okay? <laughs> <laughs> I'm also married, all right? And I've been happily married for a long time. And I'll tell you what, I do get in trouble even though I don't try, right? <laughs> and I'm not really sure why I get in trouble. It's kind of, I kind of, I know, but I, you know, but I really, you know, don't. But <laughs> these are get out of jail free cards. That's what it is. Okay, guys, let me tell you something. You, if, for all the men out there, buy this. Okay, I'm telling you, man, that's, I'm telling you, it works. It works. Okay, I have a whole safe full of get out of free jail card. You, you, you know, told me this the other day. No, no I, you know, and with my wife, I gotta tell you, and it, you know, it will, you know, when you, when you, when you went clay shooting for the 15th time that week and you really didn't do what you were supposed to be doing right or you know like you know like maybe I took the boat out or maybe I had to go fly somewhere where I really you know and um, so you know this this is your this is your card I mean this is your get out of jail free card so these are great a great gift items but to tell you the truth even on something like this like I said I mean these are the kind of things the designs and again you know you don't have to love everything we do no, but I love this. This. I love it, big bold. You saw, look, you saw it on Aaron. It's one of those looks that when you wear it in, uh, there's nowhere else to get that. And w like again, this isn't something that's mass produced where uh, that everybody you're going to see people coming and going with this no, all no, day no. long. Yeah, I mean, when these are made, we only made this one run on this. We only had enough to actually do this. It was one of those one and done ma materials. And I, I did the design. I love the design. I love the look. These are all hexagonal beads. Mm -hmm. They're all hand cut. They're graduated. Mm -hmm. And then the color on this material is mm -hmm. so unique. And this is all natural. There's nothing done to it. It's a natural quartzite. It's very, very, uh, you know, and there's quartzites come in all different colors and everything. I've never seen another quartzite. This almost looks like a, a tropical Amazonite mm -hmm. is what it kind of has that tropical does, Amazonite yeah, feel to it. Softness. But it's not. It's quartzite. Put on Aaron, though. Isn't that, that a picture's worth a thousand words? And that's probably worth about 10,000 right a, there. A, a minimum. And if it looks familiar, you might have seen it during our fashion shows with Marla Wynn or Diane Gilman. This has been a piece that our stylists have used again and again and again with our beautiful models. So if it looks familiar, that's where you've seen it before. A really popular choice. Black Friday deal, lowest pricing ever at $89.98. Again, free shipping and handling uh, all day long if you buy this. All day long you'll get free shipping on everything else you buy because you're exceeding that $75. Okay, let's, um, let's quickly remind you of the other Black Friday deals. It's not just jewelry, it's everything. For every bargain hunter out there, whether it's a carpet cleaner, an EcoFlow generator, whether it's some tall boots or a mobile phone or a video doorbell, you name it, we've got it online at hsn.com. Just search Black Friday deals. Quick reminder, obviously we caused a massive stir with our Hubei bracelet and necklace. Uh, I mean, money cannot buy it truly because you can't find it. This is genuine, authentic, signature, collectible, vintage Hubei. We are down to the final few of the bracelet. So if you missed out, the bracelet is available. It's on that fabulous stretch magic, so it's easy to wear. No fiddly clasps to worry about, on or off. Real Hubei, up to 40 years old. Uh, we had a great time discussing the story and how significant it is. If you are just joining us again, we were supposed to be doing the Hubei at this moment in time. We actually present it a little earlier since so many had pre-sold. That is your Hubei bracelet. Last call going out on 078051. Grab it while you can. Okay, let's, um, let's have some fun. If you've managed to stay with Jay and I for the past couple hours, you deserve a medal. God love you. Yeah, really. <laughs> there ought to be an award. I, there should be, an endurance <laughs> test. Uh, we want to give back with an amazing clearance buy. This is a huge customer favorite. It's blue aquamarine and green 
and strawberry aventurine. So blue aquamarine and green and strawberry aventurine. This is a combination of 32 inch faceted necklace. So a 32 inch faceted necklace. We have a bracelet available and drop earrings. Let's reveal a clearance price on all three pieces only while supplies last. I wish we had thousands of these because this is surely going to be a red hot seller. Okay, pricing on clearance, first come, first serve. The earrings are $24, less than you would pay for lookalike simulated faux. They're real. Adventurine and aquamarine. Adventurine and aquamarine. The um, bracelet is an. <laughs> Jeez, the bracelet is $34 here, guys, $34, and again, it's stretch. And that necklace is coming in at the lowest price necklace of the entire show. Remember, that is, again, longer. That is your 32-inch. The necklace is down to just $74 and change. We'll get up close and personal so you can see the beauty, the softness, the femininity of, again, the blue aquamarine and the green and strawberry color aventurine. Producer Kevin, how many of these... Uh, to go around in total between all three pieces just a smidgen over 1000 let's think about gifts let's think about the holidays and let's not forget a treat for yourself jay there's a lot to talk about here the first thing you notice though is the softness of the color the delicacy of it you know and that's what i like about this design is the on the materials okay and <clears throat> you know um when i'm working with these materials and I design, I'm very visual when I design. I, you know, like I do drawings and stuff. Um, you know, Crystal and Brian and our other artists, they, they literally, they sculpt their silver. Right. And when they, you know, they, they do a lot of that, they, they still draw, but <clears throat> I don't think, <clears throat> they all have their own different style. With me, what I do is, um, and I've often told people this, I mean, you could, if you locked me in the studio. Yes. And We've tried you, a and few you, times. Well, they actually, they, <laughs> I've always tunnel out. Um, uh, so, but the, you know, if you gave me a sketch pad and, yep. you, and you gave me, you know, the pencils and everything and said, Jay, you're not leaving this room until you come up with five designs. Right. You'd come back about two days later and all I did was eat the erasers <laughs> off the pencils, okay? <laughs> but if, if like in my studio, if you could see how I work, you take, what I do is I take the natural materials and I'm surrounded by them. And I'm, you know, I'm a hoarder, but I'm a very organized hoarder, okay? And what, what I do is everything has a place, everything's in its place, and I've got all the different uh, specimens and stuff that I still have that are workable rough. I keep specimens of them, I keep them in a certain order. And like, uh, these are quartzes, these are barrels, you know, uh, sapphires, this material. And then what I do is I go get the rough material and I start laying it out on the table. Mm. And then um, I see what goes with what, and then I sketch and I do my designs from there. And um, that's how this came about. You know, I just, when you combine these materials, they just feel so good, they're so soft, they're so comfortable, it is so mellow. Um, and it really has that when you make the jewelry, mm. you feel a mellowness, you, you feel a calmness on, on this when you do this. They're, they're just so, soothing. And you've got a natural blue aqua, and then you've got the green, and then the strawberry adventure. If I can give you a little bit of guidance on something, um, you, you see the price of the necklace is $74.98. If you buy anything else with it, so if you buy the necklace and the earrings, you'll activate free shipping. So if you buy the necklace and the earrings, you'll get free shipping on all of it. So you can wipe out the shipping and handling charge. Um, if you were to buy the necklace and the bracelet, you'll activate free shipping so you can wipe out the shipping charge. Or if you've bought anything else today at HSN, you will get free shipping and handling. Just before we continue, I just wanna give a a quick heads up if possible to our amazing producer. Um, Kevin, on, after we've presented this, can we just show everybody, I just saw this amazing Larimar uh, um, necklace. I didn't realize, we're not scheduled for a presentation, but I just noticed it out the corner of my eye and there's no escaping Larimar when I see it. Okay, so with our necklace, again, you see through here the beautiful alternating pattern that you've got of the blues, the greens, and the strawberry colors. It's significant, but it's soft. It's light and bright and airy and happy and wearable because although you've got that injection infusion of color, it's still very neutral. So you'll be able to wear this with virtually anything. And as we get into those cold, wintry, blue kind of um, uh, winter's days, this'll help lift spirits. 
earrings nearly gone. Final 175 pairs if you want the earrings. A nice drop down there, some movement. And the bracelet selling as quickly as the necklace. So the bracelet selling as quickly as the necklace if you'd like to order that. Ultimately, Jay, yes, it's a great discount. It's an amazing clearance price but you're buying gorgeous stones. I mean, you talk about aquamarine and adventuring. These are always popular. Yeah, and these are natural materials mm. too. And here again, this isn't something that really is commercially available, uh, even on, on the materials, the aqua, the, uh, the adventurings especially. I mean, they're very, really limited. And it's not something that you would actually be able to go to a, a wholesale. Like if you go to Tucson, the Gem and Mineral Show, yeah. you probably wouldn't find, you might find the aquamarine, but I doubt that you'd find the adventuring at all. I, anybody selling the adventuring rough. So these are the kind of things that as I go around the world, and we're collecting. These are the kind of things that we even run into that we have. You see this on Aaron, though? Do you know what I love about this? And honestly, I mean, can you see like the, the nice soft pastel yes. kind of effect yeah. of this? It has a very soothing, a very calming, a very, um, it's just a really kind of a, a contemporary look, but it's soft. You know, it's not harsh. And um, in here again, you've got that pop of color, but they're not overwhelming. It's a natural color combination. Again, you know how I design this is you, you take the raw materials and you know, you're, you're playing around and you just keep, you know, you keep, I keep just putting natural roughs and bringing the roughs out yeah. until I think, wow, you know, those look good together. Yeah. And there's always, you gotta watch out because when you've been doing this as long as I've been doing it, I mean, come on, you know, you do everything like turquoise and amber. Are you doing like <laughs> Don't at all? Amber? I mean, but there's certain combinations that you can't get away from. And then they find, it's like, it's just like when you're a kid and you go, oh, that again, you know, oh my God, <laughs> you're not gonna make that again, are you? And so, you know, like you gotta, you know, to stay creative, you, you've gotta surround yourself with different materials and try different looks. And like I said, this is something when we put this, when I put this together and when I, you know, put those materials together, they just talk to each other. They just they fit so nicely. The personalities work well together. I like that it's, uh, you know, you, you kind of see through as well. It's that wonderful. It's translucent. It's yeah. translucent, right? So you've, you've just got a mellowness to this, but that melange of color that you've got there is ideal. Again, I, I never want to um, uh, impress upon you to buy everything in the collection, but I do want to make sure you realize, because I'm all about saving you the money if you buy the necklace and the earrings or the necklace and the bracelet you'll unlock free shipping and handling because you'd be spending 75 dollars or more so if you think well I, i'll do the necklace and the earrings because the earrings are only 25 well 24.98 you'll get free shipping on all of it so i don't want you to just get the necklace and pay the 350 shipping if you kind of think you want the earrings as well you might as well get them because you'll unlock the free shipping and handling on this and that and everything today well you know and also and i always tell people this and sincerely mean this you know um, you know, we, we all have budgets, yep. okay? Um, and, you know, and I always ask people, you know, please don't break the bank. Don't, you know, if you've got a budget, set a budget, set, and don't break your budget. But if you were interested in this, okay, like, of course, what I would go for is the necklace, of course. I mean, that's the biggest bowl. That, it's designed, it's the main focal point, it's the centerpiece. But if you can swing it, you want to go with earrings on this also, and let me tell you why, is because you're never going to see this again yeah. as a, a combination. It's very rare as far as where would you, you know, where would you get something that would match back perfectly to that necklace? Right. So if you could get the earrings, you know, if you've got earrings that you think maybe you've got something, maybe some aqua earrings or something that went with this, and you, you, you know, you wouldn't need it. But these are the kind of things that I would encourage you to, if you could, if you could swing the necklace and the earrings, that's great. If you can swing the bracelet, then you've got a whole set, okay? But, you know, we, I make them like that. I make them as sets, and there's a reason I do the sets. I do the sets. I, you know what? I don't do the sets if it's in, like in lapis or if it's, unless it's really something unique on silver. Yeah. Uh, because then you can always have pieces that match back oh, to that. Oh, for sure. With something like this, though, with, it, unless you're buying the, from that same set, you'll never get it to where it'll, be, it'll really match, match. Um, real fast as well, I don't want to load too much into the end of the show, but if our amazing producer, Kevin, Kevin, if we could also remind folks about the this day only, it was that added necklace, that long necklace in the last hour. Um, it was the turquoise, what was it, Jay? That spinel, turquoise. Okay, spinel, redskin, turquoise, lapis. 
in rotocross. That was it. <laughs> that, this day only was that 600, I believe. Um, I want to obviously quickly mention this because we always get requests for Larimar, and we do have some Larimar. We didn't get a full presentation in the show because there's only about 300 left. But I do want you to see it because it's Larimar. It's taking us to the Caribbean, to the Dominican Republic. Jay, we're on a clearance price. That's why they didn't give it to me because that's why it's sold out nearly. Did you wear this earlier today? No. Well, and what is I didn't going even on? Know we, I didn't even know we had this. $79. Okay. All right, just so everybody knows, okay, Larimar is the only, it comes from one place in the entire planet Love Earth. This. It comes from the Dominican Republic. This is my one failure in life. <laughs> okay, but I have never, I have never gone to a mine and never closed, and not closed a deal. That has never happened to me in my life. Until Larimar. Until Larimar came along. <laughs> I went to, La okay, I w I've been to the Dominican Republic and Larimar before Larimar even became a thing, <laughs> right? When Larimar was just at, I, I learned about it in Quartzsite, mm. and um, a guy had a couple pieces of, of Larimar, rough, and so, and I'm a Caribbean guy. I mean, you know, like any excuse, you know, to like head down, go especially go south at that time. And um, I went specifically, I've been to this mine four times, but I was in Larimar when before it really became popular in eBay. Now, now it's established, it's crazy, the prices are set. It's just ridiculous what they get for the rough. I have never been able to buy the material direct from, from the mine. And will they sell it to me? Of course. But they, you know, I can't get the price right, and the, price. the quality that I need. The, you know, the quality that I need, the price is like over the moon, you know? And so I got this from another resource, The Rough. I rarely do that, but they're directly related. And they- Two minutes so, or sell out, everybody. They so, okay, they sold me The Rough. Now, what you're looking at is, uh, I had a really nice load of this, and I did quite a few designs. We sold out every single time. Yeah. This, these are some of the very, very last designs. I didn't even know that we had this, guys. I thought this was sold out, so I didn't know. This is, this is something we made, uh, but this is really high-grade Larimar. These were kind of like you can see the smaller uh, nuggets that we have. But look, you know, colors, the colors of Larimar are what, it's like tanzanite, yeah. right? Anybody, that's another thing. If you're a rock hound, if you're a gym person, if you're, you're, if you're just a, a rock hound in general, you see Larimar, you, don't, you know what Larimar is. Yeah. You don't see it anywhere else. Yeah. I mean, it's yeah. that one resource. And everybody knows what Larimar is. I mean, they know that, just like tanzanite. Okay, you, you know, tanzanite's tanzanite, right? <laughs> you, you, know, you know what it is. And so this is just something really unique and different. And what we did here on this, and I remember this design now, is in, and it's designed to do exactly what Adam's doing with it. Do you see the little black spinel, which is actually faceted? It's a form of hematite mm -hmm. um, that we get from Thailand. That, um, and we use that not only as bling and sparkle, mm -hmm. but it's also a pivot point. Yes, So yes. it actually has a function well, that where it makes the freeform beads, the natural freeforms that we have there, it gives it a pivot point so they don't rub and perfect. that they rotate and that it will be flexible instead of being stiff and break. Uh, we, folks, if you're on hold, bear with us. We're trying to, we're trying to get through as much as we can. Um, okay, so we have about a minute and a half, two minutes at the most. This is selling like crazy and it will sell out. So I wanna make sure your order is confirmed. Uh, this is real Larimar. The Larimar obviously combined with the black spinel gives it that kind of elevated look, that more luxurious look, but it's Larimar at a clearance price. So you are really in very good company. You're in a great position. This necklace has great reviews at our full price. I remember when Jay and I did it, Originally at the 143.50 price, we were bouncing off the walls because that was an amazing deal. So when I saw, I saw it out the corner of my eye on our jewelry tray, and that's why I was like, "What is this?" So I do want to thank the team for making this happen for us. I, I didn't know we had this. Okay, how much Larimar? Well, how many Larimar designs in 2023 will we have? How many? Uh, seven. Zero. Zero? <laughs> no, no I have no material. There, this is, you're looking, if you want Larimar from me, okay, the, this, I didn't even know this existed, okay? So there are no new Larimar designs coming up. I have no, no Larimar rough. There will be no Larimar designs in 2023. Wow. Absolutely zero. Wow. For any of the shows, I, I have, it. I guarantee you, uh, even if I was able to buy Huge quantities of Larimar Rough tomorrow. Yeah. Which I'm not gonna be able to, okay? But if, even if that would happen, it would take me eight months 
to be able to make anything to put it on the air. Even if I could just, even if I had it in my, in these little grubby little hands <laughs> tomorrow, it would take me eight months by the time that we uh, shipped it, got it to the laboratory shop, did the designs, did the whole thing that we have to, you know, we work out, we're already working almost uh, through mid 2023 right now, but I will tell you with confidence, mm -hmm. uh, you have my word, you will not see any Laramar designs from us next year. Well, you heard it here first, folks. And not only are you seeing the last design for the significant future, you're seeing it at a special clearance price. Um, Jay, two days this week. What a mm -hmm. wonderful and fun time. You know what? I always enjoy working with you. And we always have so much fun. And, you know, it's just, it's just, uh, you know, it's good energy. And I just love working with you every and day. I love working and I appreciate you. everybody tuning in. And I appreciate everybody supporting us through all the, all the years. And, Hopefully a few more years to come. Many years to come, Jay. Well, let's not go too many, but many years. As I said, we're locking the studio door. Don't let Jay leave. Um, one of the things, just quickly before we both sign off tonight, is to let you know our beauty hot list. So much good stuff coming up. Um, the lovely Michelle with great items, great brands. Whether it's Clinique or whether it's going to be Doll 10, there's great items that are up to 50% off. That is the beauty hot list at H. I see Jay's on his phone already. No, I'm turning off my mic. <laughs> Are you going to go and order <laughs> some beauty face cream or something? <laughs> All right. Thank you, everybody, for watching Jay and I tonight. Have a wonderful rest of your weekend. I'll be back tomorrow night at 9 p.m. for Open House. Until then, be well, be happy, and we'll see you soon. Good night, everybody. I love those two together. Jay King and Adam Freeman. It doesn't get better than that, right? Well